I'm showing you how to get Fabric for 1.16.5. To download Fabric, you want to head over to their official website, fabric.net. This is going to be linked down in the description, together actually with my Discord server, and I'd greatly appreciate it if you could join that. Anyways, here you want to click on this big blue Download for Windows button, if you have Windows of course, and the download will automatically start. Now here in my downloads, as you can see, we have the Fabric installer which is great and we can simply double click on that just like so and that is going to open up this right over here then you can select your minecraft version in this case we're going to select 1.16.5 then of course automatically here is going to be selected the latest version and unless you don't want that i recommend you keep it at that anyways then you can click on install right over there and the install process will start as well as complete there we are now, because this is just the installer, you don't actually need to keep this and you can delete it if you want. Anyways, now we can open up the Minecraft launcher. Inside of the Minecraft launcher, we can click on this menu over here and then we can select Fabric for 1.16.5 if it isn't automatically selected. Anyways, then we can simply click on Play and understand the risks of playing modded Minecraft. Now, as you can see, we have Fabric 1.16.5 working, which is great. Finally, I'll show you how to use mods with this. So you want to press on Windows and R at the same time, and then in the box that comes up, type in a percentage sign, app data, and then another percentage sign, just like so. This should bring you either into this roaming folder or into the app data folder right here. Either way, you want to make sure that you're in the folder called roaming. Then go into the .minecraft folder, and then you might need to scroll down a little until you find a folder called mods. Inside of this folder, you can put any mods you want. As you can see, I do already have one in here, but this one doesn't work for Fabric. Anyways, it is important that all the mods you put in here are made for Fabric as well as 1.16.5. Otherwise, it might not work, and Minecraft could crash. Anyways, that was basically that. If you do, however, not happen to have a mods folder, I do have a tutorial down in the description on how to fix that. Anyways, for right now, thank you ever so much for watching, and I do hope to see you again in the next one. Bye!